Hey guys, TG Cast Productions. So I have a quick video for you guys. There are three limited time liveries you can acquire this current GTA Online event week, May 18th through the 24th. So I'm just going to very quickly discuss or tell you guys how you can acquire them. The first livery can be acquired by heading over to the LS Car Meet and purchasing one of the test rides, the Bravado Banshee, which has the weekend racer livery applied to it. Now this livery was given out in the past one of the weeks in November of 2021 so you might already have this livery but if not you can purchase this test ride and you will have the livery applied to it. Now I don't recommend changing the livery on this vehicle once you purchase it and you might be wondering why I'm saying that well you're going to see exactly why once I show you the next two vehicles where you can acquire two other limited time liveries. Next up, if you head over to the Premium Deluxe Motorsports Showroom, the Dinka Blista Kanjo has the Street Samurai livery applied to it. This vehicle is a little bit more expensive than the Brado Banshee, but of course, if you're a collector of these liveries, it'd be worth the price. Now, as I stated, or you might have been wondering why earlier I said not to remove the Weekend Racer livery from the Brado Banshee. If you look at the liveries for this vehicle in the LS Customs or any garage where you can customize this vehicle, you're going to notice that the Street Samurai livery is nowhere to be found on the livery list. Now this might be partially because this livery was never released in a GTA Online as part of an event week. It's just been released as being able to just purchase these vehicles from these showrooms. Now because the Weekend Race livery was released as part of an event for the Bravado Banshee in the past, it might be in the livery list. I would just check that before you decide changing livery for the vehicle. Otherwise, you might lose it. And also, I found it rather funny that literally at the end of February, you could acquire the Street Samurai livery for the Dinka Blista Kanjo. So I'm just surprised they brought it back so soon. And lastly, if you head over to the Luxury Autos showroom, the Emperor Vector has the X029 livery applied to it. This is the most expensive vehicle with the limited time livery on it for the week. Once again, though, if you're a collector of them, it will be worth it. And this livery was never released in gta online as part of an event or through gta plus so if you head over to the mod shop you will not find it in the livery list so i definitely do not recommend changing the livery on the vehicle if you purchase it because again you may not get it back it's probably going to be deleted and that pretty much does it for the special limited time liveries for this week again they're only available may 18th through the 24th in any case, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it extremely beneficial. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, share it. As always, have a great day.